This video is brought to you by Card Empire. If you're looking for Yu-Gi-Oh, Pokemon, or Magic of the Gathering, this is the place to be. Ooh, what's up, people? Dobbs the Wars is right here, and welcome to another Yu-Gi-Oh pack opening. And it's the final pack opening of the month of Yu-Gi-Oh. Then we'll be moving on to Pokemon. Before we start, please check out Card Empire, the place to be in Manchester, Stockport, and Liverpool. And today, a quick story. During the first pandemic from 2020, when everybody was able to come out and do a bit of shopping before we got into a lockdown again because the virus went stupidly high, I went to Card Empire, things were the same, got a few things, but I also went to another shop that were in desperate need to get rid of their old stock. So they were reducing cards. They had Extreme Forces First Edition in reduce. So instead of them being 3 49 they were selling them for 2 49 So they, lost, they dropped a quid off them. So I pretty much bought a whole lot of them that they had. I couldn't buy them all because they had about 30 odd of them. So I went myself scarce and I only bought 10 of them. But if they still have these, when they do open up, I might go back and get some more. So hopefully they do have some more because this is one of my favourite sets. And if I remember, it also has ultimate rare cards in here as well. If I remember, I'm not 100% sure. But also, I think this was the time when super rares didn't really class as... Um, common rare pulls they were mainly like actual super rares they weren't like rares so hopefully they are if not never mind hopefully we can pull these ultras and the secrets but also i'm sure if this contains ultimate rare cards i'm not 100 sure but hopefully cross our fingers we get something good cue the music let's hope we can pull something good out of extreme forces first edition very old packs these are people don't remember what year they were but they are quite old nowadays not a lot of places have them anymore so let's hope we can get something good. We have Cybernet Refresh, Bit Trooper, we got the Puppeteer, we have ourselves the Mech Knight Yellow Star, and we have ourselves the Mythic Beast Medusa. Right, I think these are guaranteed super rares. We have Contact C, FA Auto Negator, the Protector, and Lookout Guard. So probably we're gonna have ourselves some Definitely, I think the super rares are going to be the guarantee pulls. I think I'm not 100 sure. Hopefully, I'm still wrong. I might be lucky there, but we'll find out after this one. We have FA Test Run, Sector Gardener. We got Sha Showdown of the Secret Sense Scroll Techniques, Bit Trooper. We have Ghostbird of Bewitchment. Oh, ultra rare! We got Mythical Bistari. Okay, I'll take it. Ultra rare. Let's go. Very happy with this. We got um, the Acute Cerberus, a Protector, and the World Shield. Now, still, I do not guarantee if that was actually a good pull. Well, that was a good pull, but I'm still not sure if the Super Rare was a good pull or not. We'll find out in a minute, hopefully. I do hope it. I do hope the Super Rare was a lucky pull. I really want these to be having just guaranteed, just standard rares and nothing else. Wow, this uh, this card's got some damage into it already. Definitely a factory error there. Hopefully the cards are... Oh no, these are damaged. Oh, these are really damaged. Oh, now it's gone. Good. So these were a bit damaged. Okay, fair enough. We have ourselves the Master King Archfiend. Nice, another Summon Skull support. One of the best ultra rares to get if you guys want to play battle launchers. This is good. The boot sector launcher is good for your battle dragon, people. Definitely, definitely, definitely awesome. And also for your uh, power tool dragon as well. This is good. That's a great card and it's a first edition. I'll take that any day. Oh my goodness, two ultra rares already. OMG, people. That is great. Super happy right there, and we still can't see if it's guaranteed us ourselves as like if that super was a good pull or not. This is unbelievable. Back to back hollows, hopefully. So let's see if we can keep this look going. Earth Shatter, right? Guarantee super rare, hundred percent. Three can be three. Uh, there can be only one <laughs> super rare. That's not bad. A sorcerer of the clown. Okay. 
So yeah, you do guarantee yourself super rares, so we got really, really lucky with two ultra rares right there and then. So I'm very happy with that. And to be honest, I'm starting to run out on sleeves already. Okay. To be honest, I think I might have myself a bit of value back. Oh my goodness, these are damaged again? They're, they're, they were damaged, so mu they must have had a bad accident in the shop or something. But hopefully, the others aren't as bad. We are Metal Rocket Dragon. <laughs> Let's go, another Ultra Rare. Are you kidding? Mythical Beast Garuda. Let's go. Oh my goodness, three Ultra Rares out of 10 packs. I'll take that. Fire Prison, um, Phantom Shot. Oh. Oh my goodness, people. Wow! Three ultra rares. Let's. I'm super, super happy with that. I can't go wrong there. Three ultra rare cards. And I think I got one of the most expensive ultra rares out there, which is that definitely that boot sector launch. That is good. I'm so happy. Keep up with these packs. Let's see what else we can pull. And remember, people, remember people these are first edition, so hopefully. Get some are good. We've got Vandra Charge and the Power of the Guardian Super Rare. Okay. Uh, Link Belt Wall Dragon. And the Angler, of course. Okay. Let's keep on sleeving these up. And we've only got we've got how many packs have we got left? We're halfway, people. Wow! Halfway and we still and we've only and we pulled three ultras. This is good. Is, have we got another damage pack? What the hell's going on? Right, good. It didn't damage the rare. Okay. We've got Beast Jackal and the Downbeat. Okay. DD Seeker. Okay. World's Legacy. Okay, okay. We'll take them. I'll take them, alright. So I'm a bit worried, people. So if these cards are a bit damaged inside. That must have been a factory error because the shop that I go, the shop that I got these from, um, were very protective with their cars. They kept them behind the counter so nobody took them or robbed them. So nobody can go ahead and damage them at all. And again, another damage there. This is that's a bit of a bummer. But luckily, the actual holographic card is right in the middle, so it can't really damage it as much. Yellow Star and Mech Knight Ignore Eclipse. Oh my goodness, a good super rare to be honest. Okay, and the duplicates as always as our commons. Whew, so let's, let me have a look how many I've got. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. Oh, I got eleven packs. I don't have don't have uh, ten. I've got eleven. Okay, so we pulled three three ultras out of a possible three, four, five, six, seven, eight packs. Okay, I think we've done well there, people. To be honest, to be very lucky indeed. We haven't got the cover card yet, so I'm probably be unlucky, and I might not even pull it. But never mind. We have ourselves another damaged pack. My goodness. Hopefully, yep. There we go. Steel one orange. Oh! <laughs> Secret rare. Let's go. OMFG people. That is good. Very happy with that. Mythical beast master Cerberus. Oh yes, that is awesome right there. It's a shame it's a pendulum card, but I will take it. That is a beautiful card right there, people. Super nice. Oh, super duper happy. We got a secret rare out of 11 packs, random as ever, reduced. You can't go wrong. Put that in a purple rain, purple rain, ultra pro sleeve right there. Very nice indeed. Oh, yes, let's go. Next pack. Two packs left. Can we keep this train rolling? Rolling on a river, people. Let's move on from the commons. We have a we have a normal rare and a Vandred core. Very good, to be honest. A good supporter for your Vandreds. We got the Elur Circle or Circuit, the Seeker, Green Horizon, and Oops, <laughs> Oops. It might as well just call itself Oof. 
One more pack, people. And to be honest, I can't, I do not mind what it could be. I don't mind whatever it could be, people. We got a secret rare and three ultras. I cannot complain at all. Really cannot. Skip the first three because they are damaged. I got myself my favorite card to use my Exodia decks, which will be Ulti Kibano. And Gem Knight Phantom. Um, how did you pronounce that word? Gem Knight Phantom Quads. Okay, I'll take it. I'm very happy with that. Under Lock Taker. Lock Down. Very nice. Or Lock Out, I meant. To be honest, I think we did not bad at all there, people. Really not bad, I don't think. You may be, Some of you may be thinking that was the baddest look ever. They were not worth the most money. But to be honest, I cannot complain. I bought these reduced and we pulled ourselves a secret rare and three ultras. You can't go wrong there. So before we do say goodbye, people, let's go through the cards really quick for our rares. And I might not, like I said, with Yu-Gi-Oh, I don't really price the rare cards. It's the, mainly the holographics we're mainly going to price. Depending on how expensive they are. If they're like worth 50p to 20p, I'm not really going to price it. But if it's like over a pound or something or 95 pence, I will price them up for you guys. So you know what you may get in the future if you do get these and find them. So it may give you a guaranteed thinking it's not worth opening up, keep them sealed for collector wise but i think we did not bad there people because i'm 100 percent sure that the best cards that we pulled is definitely the master service the the boot sector launcher and of course the other two ultra rares everything else is just pure gravy i think but either way i cannot complain super duper happy hopefully you guys enjoyed it i surely did make sure you leave a like subscribe comment down below and check out card empire the place to be in manchester stockport and liverpool and with that being said the people on sleep goes to you guys for subscribing and i'll see you guys next time cheerio not bad for you yo but now it's time for pokemon let's see what we'll get one well, that people like using it for grass we got a reverse foil uh sturdy Oh my god! Secret Red Next Ball! Oh my goodness! I thought that was the Ultra Ball for a second, but it ain't. It's the Nest Ball. Oh, baby, wait a minute. One for the. Uh, did I do. Oh! 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 Oh my god! Oh!